I mean, at the end of the day, like, he did some whole ass shit. Mm, you know what I'm no, 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 no. Man, at the end of the Ultimately, I'm not putting up blame on him saying, like, oh, he the reason why I'm in the situation that I'm in right now or whatever. Like, ultimately, I got hurt. That's how shit happened. Like, you get hurt, then, you know what I'm saying? They got to keep moving on. They move on and, and through it, through that situation, I'll say that I wasn't always the best. I didn't really understand what it mean to be rehabbing and, and doing all this exactly. real shit that they was Have you doing. ever had like, a, a, a injury that took you, like, of that magnitude? Nah, nah, nah. I ain't never had an injury that big. The only injury I had that big was, like, when I was little league, whatever, when I was little, like, seven years old, I broke my femur bone in half. I sat out of whole football mm. season when I was young, when I was a kid. But other than that, other than that, that was it. Like, I, I broke both of my hands in, in college. I sat out, I, the most I missed like two games. That was it. But I never had an injury that big. And then at that point of my injury, like, that's when I was taking off. Like, that's when I'm, I'm shooting through. Hoop. Like, the crazy thing is, I got to say this shit too. Like, my, my, my daddy, he like big UT fan, big Texas fan, like yeah. always. And I never forget, like, when I'm in Pensacola, I'm training out there in Florida. Whatever for the for the combine and everything, so I'm telling him, you know, we don't matter. Whatever. I'm telling him like, man, like bro, I'm better, I'm better than Lamar, bro. You feel me? Like y'all, the Texans need to draft me. Like you feel me? That's your team that take me to draft me. I'm better than him. You feel me? So as everything going on, I work out for Belichick personally. Like me and Belichick on the field, bro. He worked me out. You feel me on the field? He he came out need to work me out. So he worked me out. Boom. After that, I drive home. In my mind, I drive home. To Houston yeah, and go right. work out and go work out for Houston the next day. You feel me? And they knew that I worked out for Belichick. You feel me? So like that's kind of what we kind of, I guess, grew a liking to me. Like damn, like he came in there and I was a tennis like shit. I'm first in the line. I'm everything like because I really wanted to be in Houston. Don't get me wrong. Like that's what I wanted to be. Makes sense. Makes so sense. it was like shit. Like hell yeah, I'm gonna be on point when I come in here. So I kind of knew in like they wanted me. You know what I'm saying? I kind of knew in that, that they had a real interest in me. So when this shit happened, I never forget, you know, my call ID pop up, Houston Texas. Like shit, my heart dropped, you feel me? So I answered that shit. So, you know, all that, that was a great time. But going through it, it was just like, man, you know, it was it was a lot of ups and downs. But man, when, when you come and you talk about football, like it, it was nothing that they could have said about me playing football before I got injured. Like it was nothing, no problem. Everything was going good. I was hey, you about to snag like, that whole you shit. Did that whole side in the end zone. I ain't gonna lie to you, to be honest, bro. That was probably one of the best times of my life just being in that shit. Like, I used to go to practice, I used to be on the field and shit, and I used to be thinking, like, damn. Like, man, I'm really in the league. Like, this shit crazy. Like, mm -hmm. like, like, I really made it. Like, you feel me? Like, this shit, like, we dreamed about. And I used to always, like, try to tell my brother, like, bitch, like, I, like, I wish you was here. Like, I, I wish you yeah. could see this shit. Like, that shit. <laughs>